Hey guys, it's Carpenter with RV Crazy, and I wanted to talk to you a little bit tonight about back pain. I've been having a little bit of lower back pain after sleeping at night, obviously, because that's when you sleep, but I've been having a little bit of lower back pain that's really been bugging me a lot lately. It, uh, it only seems to happen after I sleep. Once I take a shower, get ready for the day, it most of the way subsides, and... I've been trying a little bit of experiments lately to see if I could make it go away. Um, I've been putting a pillow underneath my knees and underneath my butt, trying uh, just one at a time, trying and seeing what really seems to help. And it's hard to get a good idea of what what it is that actually helps. It seems to help the most right now, putting it underneath my butt. But uh, I. I mean, it's hard to say. I mean, how long till I roll off of that pillow and, you know, just kick it out of the way? I, I definitely move when I sleep. I know that. But what I did for now to kind of try it, I went and bought a body pillow and I actually stuck it underneath my mattress. And I'm going to try it kind of underneath my legs tonight. And I mean, sure. The mattress isn't quite all the way down, but I'm going to kind of try it underneath underneath my knees tonight, see how that works. It's not in the ideal position right now, but I'll adjust it and get it to where I want it. And I'll try it like that tonight, maybe for a couple nights, and we'll see, and then kind of move it to underneath my butt. And hopefully one of these actually is more of a permanent solution to to this back pain, because it's, it's not been fun. Uh... I'm not sure exactly what's causing it from reading online. It sounds like there's some uh, kind of tension in my hips, maybe. Some tight muscles in my hips. And, you know, I definitely work, you know, really hard. And so, I mean, I'm not surprised that there's, you know, tension and tight muscles and, you know, that kind of stuff. But hoping that I can kind of solve it. Because the, the most, you know, most of the time I, I just feel it after I sleep. And so, yeah. But I figure while I'm in bed, I'll show you one other thing that I did, a little modification of the RV. I made this little cell phone charging stand shelf, and I actually set it up so that I could have cords run through the, um, through the shelf, and then a phone could actually stay sitting upright. And, uh, you know, that's my old phone there. I am recording this on my new phone, but it has the wireless charger and I use that to to charge it while I sleep but that shelf's been very nice you could also use it for a cup holder in bed or anything like that and uh, pick that up at Home Depot and just cut it to fit I actually had them cut it so <laughs> I didn't want to go home and uh, get a saw or anything so I just had them cut it and then screwed it in through through there and here just pre-drilled it and screwed it and nice and solid and perfect little charging stand while I sleep because you know sometimes I sleep with my head towards the window but sometimes I also sleep with my head towards the sink it changes I uh, kind of depending on which end of the RV is a little bit higher and just kind of what I'm feeling like but hoping to uh, kick these lower back problems in the butt get rid of them. I want them gone. They are bugging me and I want them no longer. So hopefully this helps out. And yeah, if you guys have any suggestions, I, <laughs> I could really use them. Um, yeah, let's get rid of this pain. Talk to y'all later. Bye.